My lifesaver. I don't know how to thank you for changing your mind. As if you had any doubt once you got Tony involved. She's lovely. Fourth time lucky, huh? <laughs> Mel, I need your consent for this operation. Can you give me a pen? Where do I sign? Hang on, let's just go through the process. If we must. A renal artery reconstruction involves substantial risk to your remaining kidney. I know, but it's something... Uh, oi, let me finish. Sorry. Your kidney will be removed from your body while I reconstruct the arteries. I may also have to dissect into the parenchyma to deal to any branch vessel problems. This will lengthen the procedure, increase the risk of further kidney damage. I need to be sure you've taken all this into account. A hundred times. I could write a book. I am Melanie's kidney. Give me that. Got an excellent team on board today. My assisting surgeon did six months of Central's renal units. Chris, you're the one doing the op. That's all I need to know. See if her drink in the winner's box. she here? No. Where is she? You think I'd tell you? You've hurt her enough. Did I ask for your opinion? Well, you're getting it anyway. It's none of your business. What happened is between me and Sarah. Sarah was a mess. She turned to me. That makes it my business. Where is she, TK? If you don't tell me right what, now... What, what, you'll punch me? Bring it on! I want to speak to my girlfriend. Which one? The one you slept with a couple of nights ago or the one you left crying on the hotel bed? What is your problem, mate? Are you trying to stir this up? <clears throat> mate, I drove Sarah home, all right? I know what she went through, lying awake all night waiting for you to show up. And how I knocked her around when you walked out in the morning. I had no choice. There is always a choice. Oh, don't be naive. <sighs> you put your career first. Went gunning for a round of applause and a big smile from Huya. How was Sarah supposed to feel about that? Did she ask you to say all this, TK? Or are you just trying to get in touch with your inner drama queen? <sighs> She's gone, Craig. You've lost her. Suck it up. Oh yeah, Scarlett's here. It's not about Craig. She's got her exchange interview this afternoon. Yes, I've forgotten. I suppose she'll be wanting some moral support. I think so. Well, I'm the last person. Uh, I can't. I can't see it. You'll have to make up an excuse for me. Of course. Uh, t tell Scarlett. Tell her good luck. I'll be thinking of her. You've reached Sarah Potts. Please leave a message and I'll get back to you. Sorry, I didn't know you were here. Yeah, I was looking for Sarah. She's not at work. Do you know where she is? Oh, come on, Alice. I know she came back from Rotorua with TK. Did she spend the night at your place? Okay, in TK's room. But you didn't hear it from me and I didn't tell you about the tears. TK's got me on a promise. Well, she's not there now. Did she say where she was going? She barely spoke. She looked terrible. Mind you, you don't look too crash hot yourself. When did you get those scratches? No, it was just an accident. Walked into something. I bet you did. Come on, Craig. You lot abandoned the conference. Come back telling different stories. It's not hard to put two and two together. To get what? Well, three, obviously. You, Sarah, and who are you? Well, that's what people are saying. I'd hate for you to be the last to know. Yeah, me too. Thanks. See ya. You've reached Sarah Potts. Please leave a message and I'll get back to you. Sarah, I, I know you're hurt and upset. What can I do if you want to let me explain? You're not at home, you're not at work, you're not with a new roommate, TK. How many hoops are you going to put me through? I just want to... Connecting the graft. We're doing well. Can you team up a bit? All right, Russ Marcus. Call teams up to 20 degrees. I said more ice flush. Do you want to have permanent damage? What are you doing, mate? On to it. Bathe the kidney. Get the temp down. You'll be right now. Just a little excitement to wake us all up. Call teams dropping. How far? Down to 15 degrees. No problem at all. Business as usual, Mel. You just hang in there. I've had enough of this. You are a funny, warm, compassionate and very smart young man who has been through things that have matured you beyond your years. 
Give yourself some credit. I'll take the cards. No, listen to me. Jay and I love you. And it's not because of some speech you've memorised, it's because of who you are. You have to let that show through. Now go and get changed. If you look good, you feel good. I look good now. Humour me. Look, my, um... No one's ever said that sort of stuff to me before. Thank you. Essie! Where's Craig? He's not here. When's he coming back? Any second he's taking me to my student exchange interview. Oh, um, good luck with that. Thanks. Now, could you please go? We'll be cutting it fine as it is. Uh, no, I'd rather wait. He's been jamming my cell phone with messages and I'd like to put an end to that. <laughs> Sarah, you might have messed up my dad's conference presentation, but you're not hey, going to... I didn't mess up anything. You chased after him. You embarrassed him. Is that what he told you? I worked it out. <gasps> And he let you believe it. What a jerk. What a spineless don't, jerk. Don't talk about my father like that. Oh, do you want to know what really happened? No, I want you to leave. He slept with who are That's right, Scarlett. While I was waiting in his hotel room, he was in her bed. You're lying. Who are you? When he came back in the morning, he wouldn't tell me where he'd been, but I knew. And when I confronted him about it, he didn't deny it. No, you must have this so wrong. Well, then why does he keep ringing me, leaving messages saying he's sorry that he can explain? How do you explain that? That's what I want to know. That's why I'm here. I want him to tell me why it's okay for him to cheat on me. Oh, and I suppose you think I deserve this. I suppose you think I'm... I suppose you're really glad. 